Clarence living? I have lost both my parents. To lose one parent, Mr. Worthing, may be regarded as a misfortune. To lose both looks like carelessness. I am the one who was your son, don't need. Well, I'm afraid I really don't know. The fact is, Lady Bracknell, I said I had lost both my parents. It would be nearer the truth to say my parents seem to have lost me. I don't actually know who I am by birth. I was... Well, I was found. Found? You were after? The late Mr. Thomas Cardew, an old gentleman of most charitable and kindly disposition, found me in a handbag. A handbag? Yes, Lady Bracknell, I was in a handbag. A somewhat large, black, leather handbag with handles to it. An ordinary handbag, in fact. In what locality? Did this Mr. Handbag come across this ordinary handbag? In the cloakroom at Victoria Station. The cloakroom at Victoria Station? The cloakroom at Victoria Station. The cloakroom at Victoria Station? 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 Yes. A handbag? Yes. yes. I confess I feel somewhat bewildered by what you have just told me. To be born, or at any rate, bred in a handbag, whether it had handles or not. Yes. I would strongly advise you, Mr. Worthing, to try and acquire a handbag as soon as possible, and to make a definite effort to produce a handbag before the season is quite over. Well, I really don't see how I can possibly do that, Lady Bracknell. I, I, I can produce the handbag at any moment. It's in my dressing room at home. I really think that ought to satisfy you, Lady Bracknell. Me, sir? What is it to do with me? You could hardly imagine that I and Lord Bracknell would dream of allowing our only handbag brought up with the utmost care to marry into a cloakroom and form an alliance with a parcel. Good morning, Miss Worthing. Good morning, Lady Bracknell. Oh, I'll be there. Oh. 